it's there here again with another create a smile layout i'm doing this bluish layout today and i'm starting with uh, white cardstock i used some clear get gesso first and now i'm using distressed ink and a stamp we have had in our snow dance kit it's exclusive but i um, I, I would hope that everyone would get some, but it was really exclusive and I think that those kits are sold out now, but maybe maybe Christine will have some more if you really like it. Anyway, I'm using first this uh, blue distress ink and then some um, black archival ink. Uh, I'm using later some wet mediums, so I don't mind if this blue ink will spread out because I have the same text with um, archival ink which is waterproof. So I draw some circles and now I'm making some uh, special um, paste for my background. I'm mixing some blue paint then modeling paste and then magic power from the Renauts. Uh, I'm going to make this really really thick paste. It's like, um, uh, what, what do you call it? Anyway, it's uh, really, really thick and it's uh, quite hard to spread uh, through the stencil because it's so thick. You will see in a minute. Anyway, I wanted to make this thick paste because uh, after it's completely dry, it will make some crackles and crackles Crackles is something I want to do today. So I'm using exclusive stencil from Snow Dance Kit. And as you see, this is really hard to get uh, through the stencil. And I'm doing this really, really slowly because I want to have only these uh, beautiful uh, big snowflakes uh, to the background. And it's quite hard to make that. Anyway, it was very fun and I like to uh, try new techniques and try new um, mixes of uh, different mediums. So this is quite fun, even though it's quite tricky. Uh, I'm trying uh, with heat gun some uh, first, but to get those crack crackles appeared, it needs to be really, really dry. Uh, now I'm adding my paper cluster. Some of the papers are from the Snow Dance Kit and some are just some scraps I had in my drawer. Um, after I have uh, added the paper cluster, I'm adding some mists, just flicking uh, yellow and blue. And then I'm adding some water to make them go together and have this nice bluish turquoise greenish <laughs> thing on the background um, it's quite nice to do it this way not the first the mists and things on the background and then the papers because again i like to do uh, new things and try new techniques i'm adding some gel medium behind the uh, photo to make it really stick because I have these wet mediums right now there so I need something really sticky to get them um, stuck there. Um, some embellishments and title and then some some glue which doesn't work good but anyway some glue and then these uh, nice segwins again which we have in our Creative Smile store and these were also from the snow dance kit, but I think you will get them uh, from the store. Anyway, just adding these and then I'm adding some some enamel dots and that's it. Maybe some um, black, dot, uh, black flicks of uh, ink to finish the layout, but that's it. That was <laughs> done. Um, I hope you liked it because I did and I hope we'll see you soon again in two weeks. So have a happy weekend and thank you for watching and goodbye.